ada adanya ama ama mkomi It's 6.30 and you're just waking up. Mama, good morning. Good morning. Mama. Where are you going to? M Mama, I want to fetch water to wash my face. Why do you think I'm holding this? Yeah? Take this and go to the stream and fetch water while I sweep the compound. All right, Mama. Uh, what are you looking for? Mama. Where is Papa? Where is Papa? In a turn night, around this time, your father is long gone to the farm. Mba, you me Mama. Mama. What's happening? Uwa is fighting outside. Fighting where? Mama! Mama! Fighting where? Where? Where for me? Hey! Na kwa mwa Hola! Impotent man! Look at him! Drunkard! You mean? Oh! How did you rescue her? Why did you rescue her? You don't like him? Penny, what are you Should allow me to finish her? Pick up the Sarah, why are you bringing his breakfast here? I thought he would eat in his room. Oh, he said I should bring it here, then I'd rather eat with you. Oh, okay. Yeah, Mom. Good morning. How was your night? Fine. I thought you would be eating in your room. I'm surprised when you were brought everything No, I want to have my breakfast here today. Okay. I hope you're okay. Mom? Yes, the loneliness reminds me. Don't go there. Please. Don't go there. Okay. Are you sure you're okay? I'm fine. Mom, I think I have to go now. Hmm? Okay, Mom. Okay. Have a nice day. Bye. Yeah, good. How's it going? Um, what about Donna? Did you submit the plan? Yes, he dropped it, but I still need to do some correction on it. Oh, perfect. What of um, Ibe? Did he see? Did he call? I called Ryder, but I think the guys can move in okay, this afternoon. Yeah. Okay, okay. Good job. Um, I have some some mistakes that needed to complete here. Okay. Who gives me that? Get back to me. Let me have the pie.
no taburu wa go kaina 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 no taburu wa go kaina one again it went as well uh, uh, the rain is good though when the rain falls that we <coughs> i don't mind i no taburu wa go kaina o ye kaina kaina I don't worry, don't worry. Ada? Papa. Please get me some water so I can sleep. Alright. I don't worry. 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 I don't some of them are not right. Papa. I've taken what I need. If I finish all this water, how will I have space to put the pan wine from uh, wine in Bamiri's shop? Pan wine? Yes, I just want to go and take a little. In wine in Bamiri's place? So you started drinking there? Yes, I drink responsibly. It's not like your brother who goes there to lose his senses. If you drink like my brother, that means you're insane. Uh, 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 yes, not to tell me you're like your brother. You won't insult me because he's my brother. If you drink like my brother, then you're insane. Not like that. How can you be drinking? No, ma, I just we just came back from a, 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 a farm. You want to go and drink. Me, I'll go to the kitchen to cook. I will cook. You will go to drink. When you come back, I will give you food again to eat. Just more. Okay, I will bring you some. Just a little. Uh -huh. Instead of you to sit with us, keep us company, you want to go and drink. Let's okay, then, mate. Why you can alone where you go? Small now. You can alone where you go. Let me just take some. I'll be back soon. I'll be back soon. Michael. Hi, Mom. How was your day? Busy as usual. Mm. Wendy called. I saw her miss call as well. And did you call her back? No. Why? I have nothing to discuss with her. Michael, at least a hello will be okay. Ah, oh, save me that bread, Mom. I'm hungry. What do you have for dinner? Sarah! Yes, sir.
stopped picking your calls. Your phone was just ringing. Mom, I'm eating. We should call you. Hello. Good evening, Wendy. How are you? Oh, yes, he's here. He's here with me. He just came back. Okay. Wendy wants to speak with you. Mom, can't you see I'm eating? Just say hello. Please let me eat say my... Say hello, sweetie. Hello, Wendy. Wendy, can I call you back? Yeah, I'll call you back as soon as I'm done. I'm eating. Okay, bye. Thank you. I hope you're enjoying it. I'm enjoying it. Where do you want me to go to? Is this not my father's house? Oh, this is your father's house. Your father's house. Then what? Why are you standing? Why standing there? Come in and join us. Come in and join us. Let me know who is the mother and who is the daughter. Come in. I don't get anywhere. I don't get anywhere. You sit up. You sit up. Stand there and be brave. Stand there and be brave. I, 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 I will, I will still lay my hands on you. I don't blame you. I don't blame you. You know when someone is sleeping with a fowl, he is not looking for sleeping space. I will still lay my hands on you. You will see. I know one day. One day. One day. One day you go better. Yeah. Chamaka. Why are you standing here and those ones are finishing the food? Be very careful this time though. Better watch your mouth this time. I'm not in the mood to tolerate nonsense from you. I will not tolerate better comport yourself now. No, I'm not in shock. I'm only wondering if you are talking to me. If I don't comport myself, was it comport? You even said wrong comfort. If I don't comport myself, what can you do? No, what can you do? Perhaps your wife did not tell you or brief you about the heavyweight champion I won this morning. No, no, no. Sister, promote the work of my hand, though. You are very stupid. So that people like your husband, like this, will not be thinking of trying me. You are talking to my husband. Don't worry. Remind me tomorrow morning. I'll give you what you deserve. Ne. I want to eat. Let's go and make our own food. Heavyweight champion. Ah ah. Adane. I did not even realize you are sitting there. <laughs> How will you know when you are already drunk? Hey Adane. I owe you a calabash. Of cola not tomorrow morning. Uncle, okay. what would I possibly be doing with a whole calabash of cola not? Oh, Nyanko, he will ask you that kind of person. Yeah. He's the only one. Very simple. If by this time next year, no man comes for your hand in marriage, you will take it to the village square. Do you understand? You will use it to lure any of the cheap and jobless young men to bring them to your father as a dowry back to sender you bring it to your father back to sender onye lu ofu mbo so se be anya be na abo the way inside there yeah that's even better for me you you will not escape your punishment this night i'm coming in there the guys my dear Lia, if I only need Lia, but do you pick up? Up on the other. On the other. Lia, if I now feel me enjoy it.
Don't I love you? Yeah, you know when you say this thing, you make my head. Have you forgotten she was the one that took your clothes to the stream to watch this morning? Have you forgotten? Yes, 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 yes. Uncle, how are you? I'm fine. Go fetch water. Go fetch water. Go fetch water for your uncle to drink. Too much, I'm not going to drink. I'm drinking water. No, no, Ada, come, 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 come. Mama, Ada, I'm okay. You okay? I'm fine. And where is Chiamaka? Yeah. You're asking after Chiamaka again? That antelope, you know, that does not stay in the house. Yeah? Because I call, I call them. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Chao Maka. Brother, do you know that girl would have become a man? <laughs> Come, Ada. I'm sure she's the only tomboy in this village. <laughs> anyway. Hey, uh, George. Hey, brother. What has brought you to us this afternoon? Um. Nothing bad. I want to have a beer, maybe. It's just that uh, you all are aware that um, I've been around for a while, at least for two days now. Mana, eh, she na konya, gana konya, she na konya, gana konya. But um, I decided to come and pay you and your family a visit today because I'll be going back to the city first thing tomorrow morning. Oh, oh. Ha. Tomorrow in Ketia, yeah. you're going back. Yeah. I, I thought you would be with us for at least one week. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Brother, I wish I could. But um, you know my job. My job won't let me. Brother, ah. do you know that this uh, white man's job is always tasking? I know. We hardly have time for ourselves. Mm. If you plan another thing, another thing will be happening. Mm. Before you know it, people can vote you. Another one, they send you to Enugu and all that. Left for me. I would like to spend one month in this village and see other people I've not seen. Um, and, uh... City people, they always complain of uh, working tirelessly. Uh, anyway, you look good. Huh? <laughs> like you, know, you can say that again. <laughs> yes, yes. Well, thank you. <laughs> oh, dear, good. Um, brother, my second reason for coming to your house. Uh, is to ask you to allow me to take Ada with me to the city. Hi! <laughs> yes. Instead of coming, you know, calling all these Abakeleke uh, people, all these Kalaba uh, people, I said, let me call my own niece to come and stay with me. At least let me see somebody that will help me and be doing all these uh, house chores. I will not have time to go and Then I will not have time. And go and scalp for a job for her. Hey. 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 hey! You don't need to seek permission from us in order to take your niece, your brother's daughter, to the city. No, no. Anything you want to do with her, anything you want to do for her in the city, take her to the city, do it. You've done a great thing. 
He's done a great thing for us, so. Eh. Eh, eh. Can you feel What all that our wife has said now mm. is true. Oh, mm. thank you. I mean, we are one people. Yes. So what is mine mm. rightly belongs to you. So there's not a problem. Only that, um, George. Don't you think it's about time you found one of these girls and uh, settled down with her? You're not getting younger. Mm -hmm. I mean, you're getting older by the day. So I think you should uh, find one of these smart, beautiful village girls and settle down with her. That is if the ones in the city are not to your taste. Papada. Papada. Mm -hmm. George only came here to tell us that he wants to take our daughter to the city to help her. He's not here for marriage counseling. Please, Biko. Can you do if I was a Fenka? Or is he the only uh, uh, bachelor in this village? Even in the city, is he the only bachelor uh, living mama, there? Mama, mama. Your husband here is my brother. He has said it all. He just meant mention of me not getting younger. Ah. Uh, and look at what you just said. It simply means that he wouldn't allow me to take her that with me to the city. No. No, we are going to Hey, Mbano. Mbano, that is not... No, no, no. That is not what he meant, Biko. But that's exactly what I meant. Look, let me tell you. You see, none of my children will leave my house while I am still alive and able to cater for them. Papa, you know, you're not here. 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 George, your brother is only singing sweet melodies to himself. Ada is going to the city with you. She must go to the city with you. Get on, get on, car. Mama. Um. Mama. My brother here is your husband. If my own brother. I said I won't go with my own niece to my house in the city. I won't force him. Um, you all know that I've been living alone for the past 10 years. And nothing has happened to us. And we, we have been living alone here for the past 20 years, me and my family. And nothing has happened to us. Brother, I have a job. What's the meaning of this last statement you are making? Look, let me tell you. This girl sitting down here is my biological. And what I am saying is that the only time she will leave this house is when a responsible young man comes and pays dowry on her head. Papa. Yeah, you shut up. Get inside before I lose my temper with you. You cannot lose your temper on anybody. You cannot. Um, Adania, go inside the house. Pack your things, get ready. You are leaving with your uncle tomorrow to the city. Go inside the house, no problems. Get ready, pack your things. You're living with your uncle tomorrow. I'm worried if any. Bad on a job for coffee. Can you eat your marriage and Gary? Somebody that just he wants to help us. Me, your daughter. Um, and you're refusing. Mbanada, I don't know if you can't go to the city. I wouldn't want to come in between you and your husband. I thank you very much for your efforts so far. To make sure things works out. If you're going to be happy, I'm going to draw you. I'm going to draw you. I'm going to draw you. Okay. Brother, like I said before, I'll be going back to the city first thing tomorrow morning. Uh, my mother. Take care of yourself. I have to be on. I know what to do. It's okay. Please take it easy, brother. I'm going to. But don't I? Oh no. How do you? The chief. There's nothing you can do about this one. Eh, the chief. Let day break. Eh, the chief. You will see what I will do. How can you be behaving like that? Somebody wants to help you, and you are denying your daughter of what? Oh, Mbam. I'm a scholar. Can can I cook a moana that are ego? Eh? Mbam, Mbam, Mbam. Chora miao.
Why do you treat Wendy the way you do? Mom, I don't get what you're saying. Who is feeding you with all this? When was the last time you spoke with her? You promised to call her back three days ago when you were eating. And you're yet to fulfill that promise. Michael, a good woman is hard to come by. So be careful how you treat that young girl. Mom, how many times have I told you that I don't want that girl? I have nothing to do with Wendy. I can't live here and marry someone who lives abroad, not Wendy. Uh-huh. Now we're getting somewhere. You should have told me all this while that that was your problem. We'll find a way to sort it no, out. No, 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 Mom. That's just a snippet of it. Mom, I don't love her. I can't, I can't, I can't be with Wendy. Wendy cannot form part of my future as a wife. Mom, if I want to settle down, I will go for a typical African woman, well cultured, with moral principles. Not Wendy, who lives abroad and knows nothing about our people. No. So because she was raised abroad, she knows nothing about our culture. You were raised abroad as well, and you are well cultured. So what are you saying? Mom, I live abroad also. But I'm a man. And I've been able to adopt the culture of our people. And I need a woman who understands it that way. Not Wendy. Mom, Wendy is not my kind of woman. I can't be with her. Uh, Mom, I know all know this will remind you about my late father. But that's the truth. George, come. There is no time at all, Biko. Uh, Biko, let me tell you. I have to sneak out with your niece this night. Please, I want you to take her to the city. There's so much suffering in this village, George. I don't want my daughter to suffer the way I've been suffering, Biko. Look for something responsible for her to do. I want her to succeed in life. If she succeeds, we will all be happy. See, George, Biko, yeah? I don't want my daughter to suffer the same way I've been suffering, Biko. It's okay, it's okay. I understand. That was why I came in the day, to, for you, for us to at least arrange things for ourselves. But your, your, your husband, my brother, refused. Mm -hmm. But my problem here, Mamanda, is I don't know how my brother will say this if he finds out that you could even tell him about this journey. George, leave it to me. Rap on me, rap on me. In an even now, why? Rap on me or that, I'm moving away. Oh, Biko, just take her to the city, Nyaliaka. Nyaliaka, no, Bali, or Bagolani, and Cha. Ada. Ada. Brick. No. Please, when you get there, respect yourself. Remember the family where you're coming from. Biko, Ekwakwanaki, if you may be. Oh, Akalaya, Sakwami, Lueba. Oh, no. Please, remember you're one of the most distant girls in this village. I don't want you to get there and change. Promise your mother you will not change. Don't change. No. No. Okay. No. 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 I'm gonna be a millionaire. It's raining, no? Be careful, no? Uh, oh? Let's go. Give me, give me. 
<laughs> it's okay. Hey, nah. So that was why you know. Okay. I know Tabu, I go Kaila, Kaila, Kaila. I know Tabu, I go Kaila, I don't want to get ya here. I know Tabu, I go Kaila, oh, Kaila, Kaila. Where is Ada? Ada? Papa? She didn't sleep here last night, too. What are you talking about? It's not in her character. Where's your mother? She went to fetch you. Oh, see her, she's back. Ah, you're getting ready to leave. Where is Ada? I can't see the girl in the mini. I don't mean it, can't you? Away. Oh, no. <laughs> you're asking her third. Ada is uh, gone with your brother to the city. What? Mm. You mean, you mean, you took my daughter I, 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 and gave to my brother George to take to the city without my consent? I don't have anything to tell you. Yes, your daughter is gone to the city. I don't want her to live the kind of life I am living in this village. No, she doesn't have to suffer. She's gone to the city. If you like, go and fetch her. But that is if you know your way to the city. This nonsense! Absolute nonsense! I go wait, wait, wait. You mean you carry the only girl that does all the good work in this house? And, and I sent out of the city. Why didn't you give this non-entity here? Ha. Papa, hope it's not me you are referring to. Eh? Uh, since she left, are you the one sweeping this compound? Come on, shut your mouth. Shut, 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 shut your mouth. Shut down your long mouth. You're talking to your father like that. Are you okay? Shut oh. Long, long mouth. Look, if anything happens... What, she, what, what, what does she know how to do? Don't mind her. What does she know how to do? Is it not just to sweep and eat? And you, eh? If anything happens to my daughter, you will see my true colors in this house. And if she comes back with good news, will you partake in it? That's nonsense. Yeah. Let something happen to my daughter. Nothing will happen to her. She's Let's coming back with good news. By the grace of God. Whoever you may be, <laughs> live a good life. And you, for you oh. once it's 4 p.m., make sure you cook that cassava. If you like, Galiban. It's not me. We are living. Today, 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 as a matter of fact, you, you reap, reap what you sow, so, so, what so. goes around. Must surely come around. Eo, eo, eo. 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 Eo, eo, As you lay your bed, so you lie on it. It doesn't matter whoever you may be. Live a good life, it go better for you. That's how it is. That's how it is. What you become tomorrow depends on what you do. Today, today, better for you. That's how it is. That's how it is. What you become tomorrow depends on what you do. Today, 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 today. As a matter of fact, you, you reap, reap what, what you sow, 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 what goes around, must surely come around. Eo, 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 you see? That's why it's not good to live alone. <laughs> Ada, hmm? this is my living room. You, from now henceforth, it becomes your living room as well. Hi, Uncle George. Yeah? Your house is very beautiful. <laughs> hey. Thank you. Um, uh, let me help you with your bag. Let no, me take no, you to no, your no, room. Okay. Oh, let me take you to your room. Uh, Uncle George, what did you just say? I said, let me take you to your room. My room? Yes. You mean, I'm going to have one room to myself? <laughs> <laughs> of course. See, aside from my own room, I have two more bedrooms in this house. 
and we'll live in this house alone. <laughs> no. Let me run to the estate and call other people to come and stay with us. Come on, let me take you to your room. Oh, enjoy. Oh, hey, how do you go? what you do, oh. Today, today. Today, today. As a matter of fact, you, you reap, reap what, what you sow. So, so. What goes around must surely come around. Eo, eo, eo. Eo, eo, eo. Eo, eo, eo. Sorry. I'm in. I, I, I just want to compliment you. I just want to come and compliment you. This yoko is as soft as pounded yam made of enough cassava. Eh? What is wrong with you? What's the meaning of that? Moi. I will show you. Ah! Stop. What has come over you? Look. Let me use this opportunity to warn both of you. Mm. Don't deprive me of my natural privileges. Are you with me? After all, all the young men in this village, they have used your dent hole. Eh? So don't try it. So why can't you just allow my little, soft, gentle advances? Are you a young man? Come now, baby. Look at how you're huh? smelling of alcohol. Sure. You are very stupid. Now you are very stupid. Don't I drink with your father? Tell me, don't I drink with your father? Mm. Or which of your fathers here do not drink alcohol? Look at them. Hmm? Or which of your father here do not drink? After all, they drink with me. Thank you God. see what you've caused? Thank God. She only fell under my anointing. Or did I touch her? No, tell me, did I touch her? Please excuse me. Don't worry. I will see you people, eh? You go. I'm going to the elders to report to you. Don't worry. I will tell you where I was defending myself, trying to find out who you are carrying. Who is it? Who you are carrying? Very dirty. Who knows if you are carrying pampas under you? I'm helping you. Um, Maxo, you know what I can do? Yeah. She's a very good girl. Mm -hmm. And she's from a good home also. Yeah. And she's hard working as well. Mm -hmm. Trust me. She can do any kind of work you offer in your hotel. She's hardworking as well. Yes. Well, I can see she's a nice girl. So what's your level of qualification? Um, she's I'm a... Sir. I'm a high school graduate. Yes. Oh. In that case, she can work as a room service. Ah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and you can start work from tomorrow. Oh! Maxwell, thank you very much. Come on, what's our friends for, thank George? Thank you very much. All right. You are indeed a good friend. George, come, come on, come on. What's our friends My for? God will bless you. Right. <laughs> thank you very much, sir. I think God will bless you. God bless you too. <laughs> By the way, please uh, report to the manager first thing tomorrow morning for your appointment oh, letter. Definitely, definitely. <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, Maxwell. Come on. Thank you very much. It's <laughs> nothing. It's nothing. Most of you are now aware now. It's all right. It's all right. I'll meet you. Uh, <laughs> Let's not talk about it here. It's okay. 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 It's so I'm leaving with um, first flight tomorrow morning. Wow, serious? Yes. When are you coming back? Actually, I'm going to be there for a couple of days. Um, probably by weekend. Guess what? The ministry has given us the hospital project. Wow. So very soon we are going to commence work. Ah. Perfect. Wow, that's interesting. <laughs> that means I'll go and complete the drawing so that I'll send it to them before the weekend. Oh, perfect. So. Send it to my office as soon as you finish, eh? Okay, okay, sir. Okay. okay, sir. That reminds me, sir. Mm -hmm. I will need a survey plan so that I can be able to prepare the, the design layout. It's all right. I have them in my office. Just let me know.
Thank you. Thank you, sir. So, baby, I'm not going to pay me a visit now. Mm? You know I love you so much. I will come very soon. Uh, very soon. That's what you keep saying. Uh, when is this your very soon ever going to come? Mm? I will come very soon. And you know me too, I love you. Uh, and if you love me, if you love me, you prove it. Uh, you know I've missed you so much. Mm. That is what you keep saying. You will come, you will come. When is it going to be? Uh, you know I love you so much, right? I love you too. You know what? You are an idiot. You are very stupid. Let me see you here again. Uncle Uwa, what you. did you do that for? Is it because I did not give you one? It's because you are my niece. That's why I did not give you one. Are you with me? Uncle Uwa. You think I did not hear about what you did to those girls on their way to the stream? You think I did not hear about it? Oh, so you are jealous. That's why you're doing this to me. Mwawa, aka the capitalist, with this little boy. Eh? This little rat. Yeah. If you cheat on me, eh? I will do the same thing. So at the end of the day, nobody will lose. Hi. Do me, I do you. Okay. All right. Is all right. Eh? I've heard you. I will never touch any of these village girls again. Are you with me? I promise you. But sometimes I wonder, why do you take this my attitude serious towards these village girls? Why? You know, they can't compare yourself. Look at them, look at you now. Elekwa now, look at you. Oh, baby. Eh? So just, just ignore when you see me playing with them. Yeah? You know, sometimes they think I'm impotent. And will never give in at me. Mm. Yes, they think I'm impotent. I will never give in to me. Okay. So, relax this, your hot temper. Eh? When you see me, Play with them. Are you with me? Okay. It is well. Okay. Uh huh. Wait. Secondly, mm. you have to stop drinking. If not, I will not date you again. Mm. How many times would I tell you? I've told you times without number. I will stop alcohol as soon as that witch who killed my mother, your grandmother, dies. Hmm? Okay. I will stop drinking. At least, you know she took over. She succeeded my mother. You know. I will stop drinking. At least I will reduce from full bottle to three quarter a day. Uncle Lua, mm. did you hear yourself? I heard. No, did you just hear yourself? What do you mean by you will stop from one bot full bottle to three quarter? Eh? Okuluwa, let me tell you, if you don't stop drinking, I will never, 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 never be with you again, no? Come, 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 Biaku. Stand here. Okay. Okay. Simple and short. Clear and simple. I will stop drinking. But give me... Ten years. I'll stop drinking. I promise you. Ten years. No, ten years. Ten years. I, are, you, are, 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 are you serious? Uh -huh. Ten years. I love. Don't take my word serious now. Eh? Are you taking my word serious? Eh? Okay, you know what? Let's go home. Wait now, you leave. You know what? We'll use your room tonight too. Fool, you want to chop elder's meat. Idiot. Babe, wait now. Eh? Shamaka, my love. 
Eh? Where are you going to now? I'll take care of myself. I love you. I love you. <laughs> Sarah, please take care of me. <laughs> yeah, like I would I be the one to take care of her. Huh? My name is Peter. I'm new into this town, and um, I just want to—I just want you to take me around so that I can see the topography and the place. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> um, uh, is this a car? Because it doesn't look like one. It's ah, different from other. This is my car. You be careful. I okay. see. See, you are having pain this. I know why. Because see, the pain is going to get eye on you. Mm. This car is very in some way rowdy. <laughs> See, my name is Chiki. Chiki? Yes, my name is Rondestam. Okay. Every, all the taxi drivers, you ask anybody what is original Chiki. Serious? Hey, you See, you're in the right answer. That means you are the king of the city. I, the king of the streets, sir. I know every <laughs> corner. Every corner. I love that. You're very funny. Oh, my God. So, um, Chiki. Uh, yes, sir. Um, please, can you take me to a hotel that has a good serene ambia? Oh, hotel. Yes. Okay, you don't get a problem, oh. Yeah. See, see, in fact, I know all the hotels in the town. Every corner, the good ones, the bad ones, I know all. Don't bother me. No, I want good ones. Good ones, I know you are good. <laughs> okay? See, I have a place that they have good breakfast service that I can, I can proceed. I, 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 I appreciate that. Can you get me one? Ah, okay. This is a single call, <laughs> and you are thought that That's a very good, a very nice place. Thank you. Go you go see good things. You go know good things. You go, you go have good weather. Thank you. Atmosphere, good, everything good. Thank you, good. thank you, Mr. Yeah. Chiki. I appreciate that. Uh, yes, you got it. Hey, okay. uh, How many days are you in town? Wow. Uh, well, actually, I'm going to spend a couple of days. A couple of days. Yes, yes. Okay. You go end up spending a month. <laughs> I did tell you. You go love this place. Come this on, town, there'll be you. Come on, you're just funny. I'm you go places. For real? Yeah, you, you go. <laughs> you know I yeah. Ah, sir. Okay, I'm taking you straight to the hotel. I see, I see. I see. Ah, please do. Very nice place. Yes. Okay, you are too good, though. Wow. So you're taking me to the place? Yes. So I'm taking. Yes, I'm, I'm just taking you the place straight from here. The place you can go. Thank you. Yes, Thank very you. tall. Yeah. Thousand naira, sir. Okay. okay. Do you want to pay cash or? We have a POS. All right. Okay. 
Room service. Okay, hold up. I'm coming. Give me a second. Give me a second. I'm coming. Good morning. Yeah, good morning. Uh, I brought your breakfast. There you go, sir. Is there something else you might want me to get for you? Yes. Uh, no, 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 no. Everything is all right. Okay, then. Enjoy your meal. Okay. This girl that just served my breakfast a few minutes ago could surely win Miss Watt really? if she went to the contest. Really? Sure, Mother Africa has something for me. Yeah, I think you enjoy. But say you, you, you kept so long in opening the door. Oh, yeah, sure, sure, sure. sure. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, but uh, from what I'm insinuating, I can see. No, 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 it's okay. Don't see anything. Don't start insinuating anything yet, okay? Yes, just sir. make yourself comfortable. Yeah. Let me change up so that I take sure. you to the set, okay? Yeah. Breakfast. Um, which of the rooms are you talking about? Because I've slept more than 20 rooms this morning, too. The very last one. Oh! Julian, I swear, I, I don't even know what took the guy so long to open the door. I knocked on the door, he responded, and it took him mentality to come and open up. Maybe he was taking the shower. Man, I wonder what took him so long. Anyways, could you please go back to those rooms and collect all the used caps for me to wash? All right. <laughs> okay, great too. Yeah. Let me just drop this. Okay. Yeah. Safe right here. Yeah. Right. Make sure you just take care of yourself. Oh. Some water to drink. Oh. Um, I say you should bring me water to drink and you are bringing a whole bucket. You can't believe it. There's no single water in this house. So I have to wait until you go to the stream to fetch water before I drink. Where's that daughter of yours? Which daughter of yours? Why do you always call this girl this daughter of yours? Am I the one that impregnated myself to give birth to her? Besides, Okwamuna I Suba Anata. Anna picks the bucket to go and fetch the water. Am I not as tired as you are? I'm sure I'm going to kill her one of these days. You won't kill her. You will not. You won't die of thirst. Let me go fetch the water and come back. Yeah? But 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 wait, though. let me tell you something. Now you see the reason I told you Ada should stay with us in this house. You see how useful Ada was to us. If Ada were around, I wouldn't be thirsty after having worked so hard under the sun. 
thank God. You have seen the reason I don't want Ada to be in this house. I don't want Ada to be suffering the way I am suffering. I just came back from the farm with you. You are seated asking me to get you water. Now, there's no water in the house. Let me go to the stream and fetch water for you. Ada cannot see. I don't want her to be suffering the way I am suffering. Please. So why don't you post this, this one to, 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 to them also? Don't worry. Chiamaka. Yes. To go to? To judge them. To judge? Yes. God forbid. Who on earth will allow such a soul to be in his or her house? You will not die of taste. In the next 30 minutes, I'll be back. Wait, sit down. I'm not out for the alone. Women, eh, I don't understand them. Now she says this life is suffering. But when there's meat on the fire, they're the ones that will eat and lick their hands without knowing how it was shot or who tapped it. Good evening. How are you? Fine, thank you. Um, yeah, wait. Um, so, Tessa. So, is there something else you would want me to bring for you? Uh, Not really. Perfect. Um, so, I have to leave now. Okay. Excuse me. Oh. Sorry for holding your hand. Um, but you look scared. What's the problem? I mean, no harm. My name is Michael. Um, Ada. Oh, beautiful name to a perfect Biara. Uh, please, if you don't mind, can I just have the two minutes chat with you? Um, sir, if what you want to talk about is um, about this place, then I think I'm the wrong person to ask because I only started work a couple of days ago. Ah, no, 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 just pay me two minutes. Chat will be free. Okay, please. Okay, all right. Okay. Thank you. So, so like I said before, my name is Michael. I'm a contractor, a building contractor. So, this is my first time I've come into this metropolis. Oh, you're welcome then. Thank you. So, um, what exactly is the motive of me sitting here? Oh, no, I just wanted to be my friend so that you can take me around. Or your leisure hours. Oh, th that's great, but um, um, that's a great idea. But I'm sorry, it will not be possible. Why? Don't you have of this? Um, not exactly. I I get off days on Sundays, but and my Sundays are always very busy as well, so it's always jam packed. But. Don't you have members of staff who can show you around town and... You're really one of those. Excuse me. Yes, a typical African woman. With norms, values and moral responsibilities. That's why I want you to walk me around. I don't mind paying as much as you want to your authorities so that they can allow you to do that. Um, Mr. Michael, first of all, I'm breaking the rules of this hotel by staying here for this long. Second of all, like I said, it will not be possible. I really must be on my way now. So can it be tomorrow then? Perhaps. Good night, Mr. Michael. Uh -huh. So beautiful. Very interesting. Typical African woman. In my heart. Like the shadow by my side, by my side. girl, I cannot deny. Whoa, that I see you in my head. head. When I close my eyes, close my eyes. you are my sunshine. You oh, my girl, sunshine. wanna make you mine. Cause you are the sun, you are my sunshine, you are the rain that falls. You're in my head, you're in my head, you're in my head, you're in my head. Cause you are the sun, you are my 
For what he did the other day with the bottle of foreign wine. That's why I'm smelling foreign, foreign now. <laughs> Uncle Lua, huh? just listen to yourself. Look, I thought you were about to tell me that you have stopped drinking alcohol. You are here boasting of foreign drinks. Oh. He, he brought me foreign drinks. Oh, Chamaka, can you stop uh, this joke complaint? There is no time to waste time. Let's get back to the only communion. Mm -hmm. Are you okay? Mm, mm, yes, no. She's okay, so why are you screaming as if something strange happened? Uh, I came in to see if she was asleep, and I saw uh, a big uh, cat. A black one for that matter, very big. Cat? Uh, on Where's her, the cat? On her bed. Where's the cat? Um, the thing went through through the window. It didn't hurt her. Through the window? Uh, through the window. I hope it didn't hurt you. No, Papa. Papa, I'm scared. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. At least he has gone. Tomorrow I will get a carpenter to brace this window with a net. Thank eh? you. Thank you, dear mama. Go back to sleep. Sleep, sleep. Thank you. Sleep, eh? Sleep, don't uh, sleep, sleep, sleep. Eh? No, don't, don't be afraid anymore. Eh? I, I hope you're not afraid anymore. I can go and sleep.
Chiamaka, what are you sitting down there for? Take this bucket and go and fetch water from the stream. Now! I can't live. I can't. Ah, no, 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 no! I can't live. I'm going now. I'm going now. I'm going now. What kind of, what, what kind of stupid now. girl? Hey, four more. Four more. What kind of stupid girl are you? I don't know the way to describe your stubbornness. You're too stubborn. I'm not the only stubborn girl in this village. I need to kill you. Sister, you didn't go to farm today. Abi, are you on the are you on the farm uh, leave? You know, I didn't know that uh, farmers also receive leave from the Ministry of Agriculture. Anyway, how many months did they give you? Oh, what do you? Come and sit down. I want to have a word with you. Hey, sister. Since I knew you as an adult, today is the, in fact, the most respectful day of your life towards me. Hi. I appreciate this one. For that, I'll sit down. Uwa Diego, what were you doing with your niece last night? In her room. Uh, <clears throat> I, I really appreciate the fact that uh, you did not shout for your husband to know what was actually happening. I didn't know you loved me that much. You. I didn't know that you loved me to that extent. You know your attitude towards me. Uh, it just proved to me that our parents left me in your warm care. Now back to your question. I will start from the beginning. You know, as the Bible says, in the beginning was the word. I'm sure that is a John, John 1, chapter 1, verse 1. In the beginning was the word, and the word was with God, and the word was again with God. Now, the word is with me now. I'll tell you how it started. I was on my way to my room when I saw this big rat. Sister, if you see this rat, if it was looking like ordinary rat, what's man? I will go to my room and sleep. But sister, that rat was suspicious. Eh? Suddenly, I heard that same voice that called Moses. Moses, rise up, go to wilderness, and rescue my people. Immediately, I went into her room, and suddenly, come and shut your mouth. Shut up, Owa. I said, shut up. I know my daughter. I gave birth to her. I know how stubborn she is. I knew you weren't going to rape her. I saw her face yesterday, all of smiles. Smiles all over her face. Waiting for you to come and do whatever you wanted to do. Yes, yes. Uh, rod. Rod of Moses. Moses. Come on, shut your mouth, Owadiegu. Just shut your mouth. I knew why I kept quiet last night. I've received enough humiliation in this village because of you. I also kept quiet because of my husband. You know what he would have done to you if he had noticed what happened? You know. Uh, sister, you actually did very well on that one. You actually did very well on that one. Put it in bracket. That is why I'm going to reward you. As soon as Kalu pay me the money for the goat I sold to him. Biko, please, in God's name, I beg you. I want you to stop every sexual relationship you are having with my daughter. 
please just stop it. If you don't stop it, I'll poison you. Yeah. I will kill you and kill myself. Then we'll now go and meet our parents. Wherever they are, we'll be with them. Hey! Jesus Christ of my Reverend Father. Father. I mean what I am saying. Are you threatening me with death? Everybody in this village mocks me of impotency. And if my little cousin decides to console me with what God gave to her, you too, you are now warning me with death threat. Don't worry. This is my final judgment. One, I will never, ever do it again. Two, I will never eat anything from that your kitchen, nor come near it again. Jerry can can do. If it were in the olden days, wouldn't I have the privilege to marry my niece? Was our mother and father. Shut your mouth. Hey! Shut your mouth. Are you not ashamed of yourself? Look at you. So of all the girls in this village, it's only your niece you have eyes on. Ha! You are too pathetic. You are pathetic. Uwadegu, you are pathetic. Eh? Sister, sister, I know I've always been pathetic. But it's not enough for you to give me that kind of slap. And if you don't get out of my sight, I'll give you another slap. And that one will be dirty. You don't need to talk much. Idiot. It's not me that you people will give BP. Rather, you people will die on your own. It's not me. Would I be right if I said I suspect something that is going on you're not, and you are not telling me? No. Even if you say no, I think I must say it. Last night when you took dinner to room 318, you again spent more than enough time there. And when you came back, there were flashes of smiles all over your face. Ada, what is it giving you? Is it money or something? <sighs> Juliet, look, there's no truth in what you're saying. I mean, why would you say a thing like this? <sighs> he was only telling me what his mission here is. Which is? Well, that he is a building contractor and um, he's only here to supervise some projects. A contractor? And do you think he's married? Julius, what has that got to do with me? Well, um, about him being married, I do not think he is because besides, I've never seen him wear a wedding band before. So, Julius, uh, look, I need to go and check what he needs to eat. I need to find out from him. And then when I return, we can continue this uh, petty discussion, okay? Just. Hang in there. Oh, yeah, please. Uh, somebody's looking for me with something. Uh, uh, please, let me know when you arrive. Yes, yeah. Now, yeah. Thank you. Uh, please come in. The door is open. Ah, hello. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. How was your night? Fine, thank you. And how was yours? Fantastic. In fact, I dreamt a lot of other beautiful things in this city, especially you. Well, 
you can dream about this beautiful city, but I'm just surprised. Why would you dream about me? Ah, uh, you know, I'm someone who usually don't forget easily about things that I see, and I usually tell them to my dream world, so that I can be able to assess them properly. You sound very honest, but I really hope you're not one of the predators of the century. Me? Why did you say that? Oh, I, I, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. I, I did not mean to offend you. Okay, um, I, I should go. Ada, Ada, you are the most beautiful creature I've ever seen in my whole life. I can read your mind. It's nothing but despair. You are thinking there's no shred of truth in what I'm going to say. What do you feel? Your, your heart is beating fast. Yeah. The human heart feels what the eyes cannot see and reads what the mind cannot understand. Tell me that I'm lying if your heart is not beating the same way. I should go. Anna? You almost frightened me. Who is after you? No. No. So what? Exactly. But the thing is, you know, each time, whenever I have that dream, I never get to see the face. It only gets clearer when he holds me. It was the same feeling even when he held my waist. Let me help you. Has he proposed to you? No, no. No, he hasn't. But see, from the casting of insinuations, you would have charmed it if I didn't leave the room the way I did. What would have been your response if he had proposed? Juliet, I don't know. I don't know because... Juliet, I've never known any man in my life. But then something just tells you that you're in love with him, right? I'm confused. Ada. Don't be confused. Everything will be all right, okay? I'm scared. Don't be scared. Everything will be fine. So come help me. Let's do this. Hmm. Food is tasty. I'm sure she's the one that put this food. I'll be a good cook. Trust me. A good cook. Good evening, sir. Could this be the last time you call me, sir? Please. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, sir. I meant... I'm sorry, Michael. 
I said, okay, no problem. Uh, why didn't you solve my dinner this evening? Um, I was... It's okay. I, I don't know how you feel. Although our conversation wasn't complete. But I'm not going to talk about that now. I have a surprise for you. Just come with me. Come! Oh, this is Chike. I called him to take you home. Oh, hi. Hi, hi, Ada. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm lost. I mean, how did you know my name? I don't worry about that. I've told you your name. Okay. okay. Uh, come on, you need to start going. It's getting late. Yes. Okay? Yeah. Now, hold on. Go start the car. I'm sorry. What is this for? Don't worry. You can open that when you get home. All right then. Yeah. Thanks. Bye. Hey, take it easy. Let me know when you drop out. Then come. My dear, I want you to enjoy my good cooking today. Wait, wait, wait. This one, he came home early today. Um, Uncle, it's one of those days. I'm in early today. <laughs> so, Uncle, mm? why don't I take over from you whilst you listen to the good things I have for you? It's all right. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. Yeah, I bet you, Uncle. All right, I'm all ears. So, what is it you want to tell me? Careful. It's ready. Mm, it's ready. Just bring it down. Mm. Turn up your knob. Yeah. Careful. Mm -hmm. <sighs> so, what is it that you want to tell me? Uncle, remember that I told you that I will not let go of one bit of the advice you pumped into my head the last time. Yes, yes, he said so. So, what about it? Um, Uncle, I need you to kindly open my bag. There's an envelope. I need you to please bring it out and open it. This one? Yes, exactly. Okay. Where did you get this money from? Don't tell me you've been paid so soon. <laughs> Uncle George, paid? In less than two weeks of work? Oh, please, Uncle. Or did anybody give you money on the road? I dare say. Adeze, okay. I don't want to believe you stole this money. Uncle George, for Christ's sakes, it's me. Uncle, I did not steal from anybody. I mean, how can I possibly steal from anyone after everything you give me in this house? Then for God's sake, how come about this money? Okay, I'll tell you. 
Um, Uncle, there's this very gentle guy who is lodged in the hotel. Mm -hmm. I attend to him the same way I attend to every other customer that comes into the hotel. Mm -hmm. So, this afternoon... Mm -hmm. So, today, whilst I was leaving the hotel, I met him at the exit. He said he had a surprise for me. And seriously, Uncle, I was expecting something different. Oh, it's something different that is not this money. Exactly, Uncle. Something different from this. So, he also went further to tell me that he brought his driver to take me home. And that explains why I'm in earlier than the usual time. I did not go to the bus stop today. Ada, this is not what I want to hear. I want to hear how I come about this money. Where did you get it from? Uncle, that's what I'm telling you. Okay. So then, um, I, when I got into the car, he handed me this envelope and then he said to me that I should not open it, uh, but you know me now, very curious. I opened the envelope on my way here and that is how I found what you're holding. I bet. Honestly, I am still not concerned. Because I wouldn't want to face any form of humiliation from my friend who must... Humiliation from Maxwell, that word, uncle. Maybe you stole this money from any of, uh, any of their rooms. Pico, me. Pico. I'm begging you in the name of God. Please, first thing tomorrow morning, I want you to take this money with your envelope and drop it at the exact spot where you picked it from. Pico. You have known me since I was a little girl from the village. And you know that stealing is not my thing, it's not my way of life, Uncle. No, I didn't say you were a thief. But there is this hidden character in every human. Until something triggers it, you won't know it's there. Maybe back there in the village, mm. he might be a saint and all that because he will, he, 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 he will, he will not come across this kind of money. Mm. Tell me the truth, what's going on, what is happening? Eh? Uncle, see, you're now calling me a thief. Adese. Adese. Uncle. That means there is something you're not telling me. Because this man must have slept with you. Uncle. I've been in this town before you came to this city. What are you saying? No man, no, 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 no man in this city will give a young lady this amount of money without collecting anything in, in return. Adese, there is something you're not telling me. But whatever thing you have in mind, I'll keep this money. But first thing tomorrow morning, I'll follow you to that hotel. Please, dish the food and make me at the dining. I'm at it. I was just about to come and get his food. Okay. So are, you, are you returning soon? Why are you asking? Because I'm very tired and I want to go home to get some rest. Um, okay, no, I, I don't think I'll be yeah, staying long there. So as soon as I return, you'll just go. So just wait, yep? All right, then make it snappy, okay? All right, then. Sorry. Excuse me. Can you sit? 
Ja, precies. Um. Zo. From the very first day I saw you, I just fell in love with you. Stop, stop, stop. What? Stop, what? stop it. Why? Please. Stop it. Look at me. I said I love you. Please forgive me. I never knew you are a virgin. Please, I did what I did out of love. I did it out of love. I love you. And there's nothing that can change my mind from that. Let this be the beginning of our worthy relationship. Please. I love you. We are two worlds apart. But you're closer to my heart. Like the shadow by my side. Girl, I cannot deny. Oh I see you in my head. When I close my eyes, you are my sunshine. Oh, girl, wanna make you mine. Whoa. Cause you are the sun You are my sunshine You are the rain that falls You're in my head Alan, how are you doing? Oh, I'm fine, Julie. Anyways, I'm heading home. What should I get for you tomorrow? Anything nice, anything good. Alright then. Okay, good night. Okay, good night. Ada! Ada! Are you alright? Ada! Ada! Ada, what is wrong with you? Are you alright? I'm fine, I'm alright. Ada! Hey, I'm here. I'm here. Ada! Hey, hey, uh, hey, hi, um, what is wrong in here? I don't know. Is, is she fighting anyone? I don't know what is bugging her. Anyways, who are you? Um, I'm a friend. A friend? I didn't know she's got a friend. Yeah, she's got one. <laughs> Wait, I, I, I want to ask you a question. Um, can I be a friend too? I've got a friend. If you need a friend, go find yourself one. Okay, uh, wait. Oh, relax. No, no, they look me like this, so. Uh, I, I just want to do you a favor. At least, can I drop you? I'm not going to take money. I don't need your favor. Wait, wait, wait. wait. <laughs> don't do this, okay? See, I don't mean any harm. Now, me, they pick come go house. I'll be taxi driver. Is that all? Relax. I won't just help you. Why they talk like that? They talk, you know they chop. I don't need your car. You still don't need them. No, wait, you go need them.
Yeah, hello. Um, um, yeah, yeah, yes, sir. Um, please, uh, I don't refuse to come with me. Or... Did she tell you why? No, 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 no. I, I, I asked, but she, she didn't say anything. All right, no problem. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Okay, okay. Thank you, sir. This time. Adesa, you're still lying in bed. What is it? Are you not going to work today? No, Uncle. Good morning. <sighs> Good morning. Are you sick or did you fight with any of your colleagues? Uncle, I did not quarrel with anybody. Uh, I just don't feel all right. <sighs> Adeze. Adeze. I hope this has nothing to do with the, the money you brought home yesterday. No, not at all. Then get up, let me take you to the hospital before it gets worse. Uncle, look, you do not need to worry yourself. It's just a minor headache. I already took painkillers for it. It's all right. I hope you can take care of yourself. I have to go to work now. In case if there's any development, and they want to let me know. Uh -huh. That reminds me. I bought this one for you yesterday. Check it. Please. I stored my number in it. There is airtime in it. Okay? Take care of yourself. Uh -huh. That reminds me. Don't bother to cook anything. I will come back early to prepare something for us. Just try and be good. Come on, come on, come on. That'd be good. <laughs> All right. Yeah, bye. Chiamaka. Mama. What is wrong with you? Mama, I'm feeling cold. You're feeling cold? Mm. Yes, ma'am. Have you seen your menses this month? If you go soy? Mba, it's not yet time. It's not yet time. You're lying to your mother. It's not yet time. Chiamaka. You see your menses every third day in every month. And we're in the ninth day. You're lying to your mother. Or you think I don't check the dates? Yeah? Mama, I'm not lying. My period changed since two months ago. Come and shut your mouth. My journey period in a change last month. Oh change in no change in any. Why are you lying? Chiamaka, you're pregnant. Mama, I'm not pregnant. Chiamaka, I said you're pregnant. Hey, Chimo. Chiamaka, I just hope it's not to Wadiego, your uncle. I just hope it's not to Wadiego. No, I was asking if uh, Wadiego visited. Uh, and what's the matter with this woman? Uh, she's sick. Oh. Uh, okay, I will get her some herbs uh, from the bush on my way back. Okay. Uh, but uh, better still, uh, why not uh, get to the chemist and tell them what is happening to her? 
Tell them the way it's uh, because one or three are all eating. I have more faith in our local herbs. I'll get us some herbs from the roof. Okay. You stay at home and take care. Okay. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Okay, you know. Oh. You're pregnant. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I, I know, don't worry, don't worry about that. There's a new development. Yeah. From now on, you're going to be using this car. Don't forget that thing, I joke. Let's go. No, 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 don't worry. Pack your car somewhere, you're going to be using this one. Okay. This is the key. Are you serious, okay? Yes. Then let me go and pack this one. Uh, no, no, it's okay. This is your clothes. So I want you to, you know, change your stuff. You know, change your wardrobe so that you look more sharper. Okay? Oh, okay, I'm fine. I'm fine like this. Too. I don't need it. To this, you know? <laughs> hey, okay, so it's alright. Hey, okay. They will take me plenty money. Let me go. And... Don't worry about that. I will take care of it. Ah, okay, be you. <laughs> hey, okay, you too much. Okay, are you are you Ah, no problem, funny guy. <laughs> ah. You have gotten what you wanted. Leave my house now before I do something very regrettable. I can never live here. Until you listen to what I've got to say. You can go ahead and do whatever you want to do. Oh. Okay. You can have your time. What are you still doing here? Ada, will you marry me? Take your ring away, Michael. Take your ring away because I do not need it. You know, I wonder how, as wealthy as you are, you decided to pick me a common room service girl to spend the rest of your life with. Amongst all the girls in London and all the girls in the rest of the world. I'm beginning to imagine what your true intentions are. Michael, please leave my house before I call on my uncle to come and deal with you. Oh, I'll be glad to see him. I will be glad to tell you what the future has for both of us. Give me the chance to let the entire universe how important you are to me. I know my life will be much better if you walk the path with me. I will remain happy the rest of my life. Please. Please. Please, come on. Please. We are two worlds apart. But you're closer to my heart. Like the shadow. Yes, one more thing. What? I want you to quit your job. Quit my job. Michael, why would I do that? Besides, you know, I just started. I haven't even saved up enough money to send back to my family in the village. 
don't worry about that. I have enough money to give you so that you send your family in the village. My fiancé can no longer work as a home service in a hotel, okay? Okay. I give up. We are two worlds apart. Um, let's just say when my uncle comes back, I will discuss it with him and then I can relay the way forward back to you. There's no problem. I will go out now. To work? Yes. <laughs> no, Michael, no. You know I haven't even had a descent back this morning. <laughs> What is that? You smell like a rose flower at the bank of the river. We are two worlds apart. <laughs> All right, then. But you're closer to my heart. Okay, okay. And you stay put. Like the Whoever you may be, live a good life. It go better for you. Oh. That's how it is. That's how it is. What you become tomorrow depends on what you do. Come around. 